Hello, and welcome to Scorn. I'm sure like many of you, I've been waiting a long, long time for this, but now the game has finally been released. So if you want to get it for yourselves, you'll find the links and the details all down below in the description, alright? So about a month ago, I was very kindly given the chance to play the first couple of chapters, and I really, really enjoyed them. It was a unique, different kind of gaming experience, often quite sick and twisted, all set in beautifully grotesque environments. Really, really interesting. Honestly, I can't wait to get back into the world of Scorn and play some more, and I really hope you enjoy it. If you do, leave this video a like, leave your thoughts down below in the comments, alright? Let's begin a new game! Now, I'll admit, it doesn't look like a very good start, but don't worry, I'm not dead. Not yet, at least. There you go. He's opening his eyes. He's waking up. He's alright. There you go. boy. Right, I need you to get up, because we've got a lot of work to do. It seems like we're going to be playing through the same sections as the demo, so I'm going to know what I'm doing here. If you want to see my blind reaction to these sections, then I suggest you watch the previous video, alright? But here we are. We're in control. Welcome back to the world of Scorn, everyone, and welcome to what I think is a door. A door that I can't seem to open. I think I'm missing something. I never found that something in the demo, but perhaps this time. Well, <laughs> hopefully sometime during the full game, right? I really want to see what's through there. Right, for now, we're just going to have to go around. So yeah. I don't want to rush through this, but just please bear in mind that I do know what I'm doing. For the most part, at least. But yeah, let's just take all this in again. Look at these visuals. Look at the environment. They really are something else, aren't they? Everything looks very biological and organic. Everything looks quite slimy. It's quite wet and sticky, you know? I think I said it in the previous video, but I don't mind saying it again. I think this is like H.R. Geiger's wet dream. I think he would really, really appreciate this. It's now the second time I'm going through this section, and I really appreciate this. Okay. Here we are then. I think what I'm going to need to do is to go down that way. We are going to be going down there, aren't we? Yeah, we've got quite a lot to do. We're going to need some help. Yeah. Okay, we've got another one of these doors. Again, I suppose I won't be able to go through, but I'm going to try. Nah, I'm still missing something. I wonder if I need to find something and, and press it up against this? Or are these buttons? Is there a combination that I'm missing? I'm not sure, but hopefully I am sure by the end of this video. But yeah, let's go down this way, shall we? Yeah, especially here, it looks very sticky, very slimy. It feels, you know, not so much like a building, but like I'm inside an organic being. Right, we should be able to get through here. With a little bit of effort, anyway. <laughs> there you go, and there you go. I think, uh, essentially, I've just locked myself in, so there's no going back. Right. So, let's see. 
I want to go through there, and I think this is the console to do it. But right now, I can't use it. I'm missing something. But that's something I can get over here, right? Yeah. I just have to insert my arm into this device. Oof. Oh man, yeah, that doesn't look like a pleasant experience, but... That's what I was missing. That needle, yeah. I just needed to get augmented, essentially. With that now on my arm, if I try this again, it should work, right? Alright, so yeah, the needle goes in there, gets twisted. My right hand goes in this glove, which is disgustingly connected. And yes, now I've got control of the door and these two components. So let's start with this one. Let's unlock it. And let's roll this to the side. There you go. Right, I'm going to exit out of this because I don't think it's going to stay open for too long. No, it's not. Right, come on, come on, come on. Oof. Just about made it. Right, if you're wondering what these are, we'll find out a little later on, I think. Just look at this place. Yeah, visually, this is this is incredible. Okay, uh, so where do we begin here? Um, right, I think, much like the demo, what we want to do is we want to open this giant door here. Alright? So these two things are actually consoles to open the door. So let's try this one first. Again, the needle goes in. And my fingers slot in there. Right. I'm trying to open the door, but as you can see, the locking mechanism is still in place. The locking mechanism is actually controlled by this. So, in go the fingers. <laughs> and the locks go up. But not for long. What we need is two people to open this door. So yeah, I'm going to need some help. Whereabouts do I get that help from? Hmm, let's see. Yeah, I'm going to see if I can do pretty much exactly what I did in the demo again, with uh, maybe a couple of changes. Yeah, I think I made maybe a couple of mistakes before. Mistakes in this room here. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, this time I, I don't think I want to scoop. Right, we're going to need to use this. If you're at all squeamish, or, you know, if body horror is the thing that you don't like, you know, this game is going to get you to squirm, I think. This is going to be a problem for you. <laughs> Alright. So, let's see. Okay, so we've gone up a couple of levels. And now we need to do, well, I guess the first proper puzzle of the game. We've got, well, we've, <laughs> we've got two consoles here. I think there used to be a third, but that one's deteriorated a little bit. I don't want to use that one quite yet. Instead, what I want to do is use this one and see if I can organize a few things to the right. Okay, so now I've got access to this arm, which can pick up these various pods and move them around. Some of them are connected, as you can see. Some of them are just singles. Uh, I need to get the right pod to that top left section there, so it can be grabbed by the arm, okay? Uh, I think it's one of these two that I need. Right, in fact, I think it's the one that I've got in the claw right now. This one by itself, that's, that's not going to work, is it? But, well, let's see, let's see. Let's drag this along. And let me show you what I'm going for here. Okay, so that goes up there. Let's exit out of that one, and let's try the other console, shall we? Yeah. I don't like the way the fingers just go in there. Right. Okay. So, we're trying to grab that pod and then put it onto that elevator system there, but that one had deteriorated so much that it just fell apart. The other one is going to be a bit more sturdy, but the other one is going to be a little bit more difficult to move. 
So what this essentially is going to turn into is a, a wall-sized slide puzzle. So let's see. There we go. I think everything's out the way now, so I should be able to drag this one all the way along with its partner. And up to the top left. Let's leave it right there, okay? Alright, so let's try this again. Alright, let's grab hold of it. It hasn't broken. You might be able to see... Yeah, there's some arms, there's some legs dangling out of it. There's someone in there. And that someone is now going down that little elevator. We're going to have to go down and meet him. Here we are again, then. I'm looking for my new friend. Where is he? Looks like he's going to be on the other side of this tower. There you go. There he is. Right. So, we're going to have to use something to get him down. This claw. I can see him up there, squirming, wriggling. Yeah, he wants out. And I want to get him out. Okay. Let's see. So, if I use here... Alright, so that goes up. That unhooks him. There you go. Now let's take him down and give him a seat, shall we? Alright. Okay. You may have noticed there's, uh, there's some tracks on the floor. We're going to be using them now. Hey again, buddy. So sorry for last time. Really. Uh, I, I'm not going to make the same mistake, alright? I'm probably going to make a completely different mistake. Let's go. Right, this time you're going to be okay, aren't you? What's his name, do you think? Let's call him Mike. Yeah. The detail on his model, his animations. Again, something else. Okay. Uh, I'm going to have to use this. I don't think I can actually get any further without using it. So, in go the fingers. Mike, I'm sorry. Ooh. Something's been attached to the top of his pod. And obviously he doesn't like that. I think that hurt him quite a bit. Look at that blood. Look at him trying to break free. Right, okay, okay. I'm sorry, man, I'm sorry. Uh, so, let's see. Ah, yes, okay. There's something that I'm going to need to do. Some of these tracks are sort of out of line. If I follow this one, that's going to lead him to a dead end. If we go down this way, that's going to take him into that room. If you want to see what happens in that room, check the previous video. Instead, I think what I want to do is send him around here and maybe through into there. So he's basically done a full lap. To control the tracks, I need to go to the top of the tower. Ah, oh, this is so good. This is so good. I'm so, so glad I'm playing this again. Alright, so we get sort of a, a bird's eye perspective here. So we can actually see where he is right now. There you go. Um, there you go. That, I think, is correct. So we're going to go past the first two junctions and into the third, alright? Yeah. Hopefully this works out better for Mike and maybe better for me as well. This is going to be something new, something that I didn't try previously. Alright, so here we are. Sorry, buddy. He doesn't seem quite so frantic now. I think he's maybe getting used to the pain. Poor guy. He's almost got a mouth. Ah, he's, he's trying to speak. It's like it's been sewn up. Right, don't worry. We're not going that way this time, mate. 
We're not going that way. We're going this way. This way is going to be much better, right? Right? <laughs> Let's hope so. Okay, so off to the right here. And, uh, yeah, let's see what this room is going to do. I'm maybe going to be horrified. I, I don't know. I really do feel sorry for him. Hopefully he's going to be okay. Alright, round here. So far, so good. Okay. Looks like this is the end of the line. Is this where I drop you off? Yes, it is. Okay, so what do we got here? Looks like there's another machine. Another couple of consoles to use. Right, let's use this one first, shall we? Okay. Right, so let's use. Oop. Don't worry, Mike, you're gonna be okay. I promise, alright? Let's move him over to the right side now and into another chair. This time I'm not seeing a scoop. That's gotta be good, right? Okay, use. Alright, we're gonna place him down here. Oh, oh, quite clumsily. Oh dear. Uh, alright. Um,. Hopefully he's not suffocating in there. I don't know, maybe it's a good thing that he doesn't see any of this. Right, so what does this do? Oh god! Oh no! Oh my com- Oh, I'm so sorry, Mike! Oh, he's the- Oh! Oh, jeez! Is he still alive? That went right through his spine! I mean, it, it cut him out of the pod, right? He's still alive, though! Oh, man. I am so sorry. I wouldn't be doing this unless I needed your help, and I need your help. Man, look at this! Is he? Oh, oh! Can I help him up? Is he gonna be okay? Oh man, right. I, you probably hate me right now, but I wish I, oh, I wish I could help him. Oh man, I feel so sorry for Mike. Right, take his hand, lift him up. You know, help him out a little bit. This is like baby's first steps, right? I think he's doing remarkably well, considering what he's just been through. Bloody hell, I didn't see that sore at the back. Right, come on, come on, you can do it, you can do it. We're gonna need to go somewhere... There. We're gonna need to go there. Right. Hey, look at this! Alright! Well done! Well done. You poor, poor man. Or whatever you are. Right, okay. So... Over here. Yeah, it's this device. What I need is I need to give his arm the augment, right? Oh, wow! Look at him! Mate, I am... I am so impressed. I'm so glad I did it this way, this time. Yeah, before... Well, we didn't see too much of Mike. Right, come on. Come to Daddy. Come to daddy and then stick your hand in there. Again, I think it's going to be pretty painful. It didn't look very- Oh! Oh! Oh man! Hang on, can I- Okay, maybe this time I, I can help him up, yeah! Oh no, don't- No, come on, come on. Alright. Oh. Right, in it goes. Ooh. Right. Hey, you, you, okay. Did it work? It looks like it worked, yeah. He's got the same kind of thing that I have on my left arm. Right. 
Again, I, I, I'm so, so sorry. Don't worry, you're not going to have to go through it again. Right. Uh, so let's see. It's it's through this way. Past these pump jack looking things. Is he still... Right? He's still trying to follow me. Oh, man. Bless him. Bless his cotton socks. We're actually not too far away from these consoles. Not too far away from the door. Uh, I think ideally he's going to want to do that. And I'm going to want to do the lock. Yeah. I, ooh. Honestly, mate, considering that you've been alive for like five minutes, you're doing pretty well. Okay? Just a little bit further, alright? Come on, I just need your- oh no. I need your help, then we can both get out together, okay? I don't have a great deal of compassion. I, I just know I need to get through this door and... Well, screw him, kind of, right? Okay. There you are. Right, so... With that being done, if I try and release the locks, we should get the door open. That's it. That's it! Okay! And this time around, he didn't die. Good! Right. Okay. Right. Mike, what do I do now? It doesn't look like I can do anything. Oh dear. Wait, are you stuck in there? Are you trapped? Oh man. Oh dear. Right, okay. Maybe a quick death was a, a small mercy. I, I, I don't know. Thank you for all your help, Mike. Thank you so much. Oh. Oh, actually, no, that's good. That's good. To be honest, if the door closed, that probably means he's been released, right? That's what I'm going to keep telling myself at night when I can't sleep anyway. Man. Well, there you go. That was a little bit different. Okay. So, again, in go the fingers. Are we going up or down? This time, we're going up. So, yeah. What did you think about that? Was that a better way of dealing with it in comparison to last time? I think so. I think so, for the most part. Alright, okay. So, what comes next? Ah, yes. The bodies. So many bodies going into this. I, I don't know what this is meant to be. A, some sort of furnace? An extractor? It seems to feed into this machine. I, I, I don't know. It kind of resembles a heart. Okay. Um, I think we're going to need some more help. But this time, not of a person, but of a tool. Of a weapon. And I think I can get it around here. So this was all part of the demo, but pretty soon, it won't be. Pretty soon, I'll have no clue what I'm doing. There we go. Looks like it's still attached by an umbilical cord, and look at what's inside it. Everything in this is so gruesome, but I love it. Okay, here we go. Our first tool, and I think weapon as well. There you go, yeah. It's kind of like a pneumatic drill or something like that. Um, let's see. Let's go over here to begin with. We need to go to both sides of this room and, and use this thing, I believe. Alright. Yeah, it needs to get inserted here. These shutter-looking things come down, and then these guys come out. Right. That's... that's important. I'm gonna need that. That pod. So that's getting taken away. Taking a ride on the ceiling. I'm gonna need to follow it. 
Right, let's see. These things, they're looking after these monstrosities. I don't know what you want to call them. Spraying them with something. That spray is quite lethal, so I need to stop them. And that's how we do it. Right. Okay. Another couple here. Okay. Alright, I think I'm going to need to get rid of you as well. Right, done. Alright. We're through. We're through to where we need to be anyway. So here it is. This is where it gets dropped off. There's another one, and there's an empty socket over there. Right. Let's see. So, in goes the needle and the hand, and we're going to control this. Yeah. So this little thing flies around, and uh, well, let's let's use it on this one first. If I hover here, yeah, the pod comes up, and I can actually pick this up, right? Okay. Sort of loaded it in like a, a bullet in a gun. But now, of course, it needs to go into this tower here. Okay. Right, so that emerges from the ground. Let's see. I can use it? I can use it. Okay. By the way, if you're wondering what's going on here, well, that makes two of us. I may have played through this bit before, but it doesn't mean I understand it. <laughs> Okay, seems like it's locked into position. And again, more shutters go up. Let's take a look, shall we? Alright. So it looks to me like we've got a way out of here. Wow. Look at this. This place is huge. You know, it's vast. I, I can't even see where that ends up. But I imagine this lasting for, you know, like, miles, potentially. Right. It's like a spiral staircase to nothing, at least currently. So, I think what we need to do is use the other pods. There's another one ready and waiting, so let's use that one next, shall we? Alright. So, there you go. Looks like it's ready. So that's going to get loaded in, and that's going to go all the way up there, is it? Okay, let's just fly this thing up. Alright. Good stuff. Again, I've got another one of these, so I'm going to have to go put my fingers in and give it a twist. I should mention, by the way, we are approaching the end of the demo section, so pretty soon I won't be a know-it-all. Pretty soon I won't really know what I'm doing, and the discovery process will begin again. Alright, there you go. More shutters go up. Let's go take a look over there. But there is one more that we need to put in. Looks like another spiral staircase. Just another view of this. What do you think that is? Is it like a, a spinal cord or a blood vessel, a vein, something like that? I'm not really sure. Right. Let's get that third one, shall we? I should be able to run around in this direction. Yeah. Just sort of bobbing and weaving in amongst these things. Okay. Right, so yeah, just like on the other side, there's a machine where I need to use this tool. So, it's going to go in. And of course, that means that more of these things are going to come out and block my path. I suppose what I could do, really, is just run around the other way. Yeah. goes, just like the other one. Alright. 
I'm going to meet it round there. But I think I'm going to go this way instead. Yeah. Here we are again then. And there you go. The third pod is ready to be picked up. There you are. Sorted. Right, so it's somewhere on this left side. There you go. That's where it needs to go. Just a little bit higher. That's it. I gotta say, even though the game is really, you know, wildly abstract for the most part, the controls are pretty seamless, pretty intuitive. You know what you're doing with them. Right, so around here. And again, the fingers go in. <sighs> right. I don't think that's supposed to happen. No. Right, there is something coming out of that tower. Some sort of sludge. What... What is this stuff? it is, is spreading very, very quickly. And I'm caught up inside of it. That is where the demo section ended. From here on out, it's going to be a blind playthrough, alright? Whoa! What the hell is this? I don't think I'm in control here. Man. Okay. Much like the beginning, I'm escaping. My encasing. That stuff is hardened all around me, it looks like. There you go. Oh, shit. Right. Okay. I, something's connected to me. It's... Whoa! like an umbilical cord, I think. I guess I wasn't the first person to fall out of there. Okay, I'm still not dead. <laughs> this guy's a survivor, right? Yeah. Yeah. It is an umbilical cord, essentially. I don't know if I was feeding off this thing, or something was feeding off of me. Oh! Oh! Oh man! That went in deep! Wow, there's, there's actually quite a few people. Alright. Here we are, we're back in control. Look at all this. Look at all those pods. I'm not the first to do this, but, well, hopefully I'm going to be the first to survive. Man, they go up really high, too. There's so many. Right. Where are we, exactly? This game leaves you with a lot of questions. And a lot of questions that it doesn't outright answer. If we're going to want to figure any of this out... We're just going to have to really pay attention to the environmental storytelling, I think. But that's what makes this so interesting. Alright. Okay, there's a, a corpse down here. Looks like not everyone died in the fall. A few people did actually try and make it somewhere. I, I, I don't know where I'm going. It looks like a, a desert here. I'm getting, um, Amnesia Rebirth vibes. What the hell is that? Man, it looks like an organ or something. I don't even know where to begin. Okay, looks like there might be something over there. 
I might have a choice here. Which way do I go? For once, I'm actually going to go right. I'm going to go for this. This looks like a, an archway. Maybe part of that building that I was in? It's hard to say. More bodies this way. Man. To be honest, at this point, I'm not even sure that I'm playing as the same character. I might be just someone else who woke up in a different area. Who knows at this point, right? Leave your thoughts and your theories down below in the comments. I'd love to read what you guys think. Okay. Down there? Should we... Oh, no, that doesn't seem like a very good idea. Another archway? Another one of these weird organs. Is it still alive? I... I, I don't know. Oh boy, yeah. Mm, this doesn't seem like a good idea at all. No. Right. Uh, let's see. Okay, looks like there is a way up. Yeah, let's head towards this archway. Past yet more bodies. Man. What is going on here? Look at that. That's massive. Alright. Oh, jeez! That's even bigger! <laughs> Is this the area that we saw in that beginning cutscene? I, I don't know, to be honest. I don't even know what was going on there. Was that a memory or a vision of the future? Based on what I'm seeing, maybe a vision of the future. Looks like this is being blown away in the wind. Wow. Looks like a couple of exhausts here. Maybe I can go inside. So many of these things. Right. Can we? Don't know if it's wise, but yeah, can we? Let's climb up the rubble. No, ah, uh, no, I don't think so. I don't think so. Oh, maybe there's another way in, right? Oh, hang on. Oh, jeez, what? Oh, this is, this is much bigger than I thought. It's all one building? Oh, man, all right. Is that where I was before? Maybe this is something else. Maybe that giant pipe that we saw. Maybe this is what that was connected to. And all around me, I keep seeing these. Yeah, so many of them. Okay, it looks like there's actually a path through the valley down here. Pods on the walls. More of these, like, giant red organs. Kind of looks like the red stuff from, um, War of the Worlds, actually. Yeah. It's all over the floor, all over the walls. These giant cliff faces all around us. And... Alright. Looks like we got some lights on over here. Okay. Oh. Looks like there's a bit of a break in the side. Maybe I could sneak in. Uh, looks like there's a bit of a gully in the way. I don't know if I can go around, can I? Uh, no. Unfortunately not, no. Alright, well maybe I don't want to go inside. Maybe my destination's elsewhere. Definitely looks like there's power of some sort, though. I'm just gonna sort of hug the perimeter of this building. And maybe I'm gonna find a way in. What is that? Is that a way in? I think it might be. We're following the tracks. The door is open. Where is this place? What is this place? 
Why is this place? I've got so many questions! So many, many questions. Wow. This all seems to be situated in the middle of a crater as well. Giant cliff faces all around us. Alright, okay. This looks familiar. <laughs> Alright. Here we go then. Uh, is that a door? I think it might be. I don't know if it's going to power up. I, no, I don't think it's opened in quite a long time. Right. Maybe. Maybe I'm back where I was a minute ago. This is that stuff, right? These are the, the spiral staircases that didn't seem to go anywhere? We had a good view of the pipe. We're in the same place. But what's this? This is new. Okay. Oh. Oh dear. What the hell's that? Okay, right. Yep. Yeah. Maybe I'm going to find myself another building to go into. Fuck me. What was that? A tail? Whatever it was, I think it just slithered off into the ceiling. Of course I can't go that way. Shit. Oh boy. Alright. What we got here? Oh, I can see it. I can see it. That looks like bad news to me. Oh boy, right. Jeez. So, hang on. I'm on the upper level, aren't I? That's the tower where I inserted those pods. At least I think so. But what happened to this place? How long has it been? Seems like it may have been a long, long time. I don't know. Oh boy. Is that its den? I can hear it. Oh, I can see it too. What is that? That's the tool I was using, isn't it? I, oh, okay, right, yep. Uh, let's not anger it. <laughs> um... Right, well, I think I'm going to have to go this way. Okay. Right. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this, this seems familiar. This is that sort of heart again, isn't it? Oh boy. Yeah. Yeah, this is the same place, I'm convinced now. Oh boy. Right. Let's go left, shall we? Yeah, this time I want to go left. Towards... I don't know. Oh, something I can use, though. Something over here? No? Oh, I've never seen these before. What do I need for that? Do I need to insert something? Would I need a weapon to break this? What have we got here? Hmm... Right, I can't step around annoyingly. That looks like it might be for... Hmm. That's an elevator, isn't it? Right. There's no way around? Shit. Probably something to do with one of these, right? But... Hmm. Okay, I'll have to come back a little bit later. I need to find something. Right, let's go this way. So, the bodies are down there, is that right? Yeah. Yeah. It may have been days, weeks, months since that accident, I'm not sure. Oh, I was out there looking in, wasn't I? Right. Well, I got in eventually. <laughs> okay. Looks like a dead end to me. Nothing down here? No? Oh, man. Crap. 
around here. Oh yeah. Oh, another one of these doors. It looks powered up. Yeah. But still, I can't get in. What am I missing? Can't I press that top left part of the triangle? I swear it's going to be a combination or something. I wonder if we're going to see Mike. I kind of hope so, but I, I can't imagine he survived all this. Ah, right. I, I can't walk around, unfortunately. Hmm. Okay. What we... Oh, okay. What's this? Something I can't use. And you? Wait, there's something down there. What is that? Alright. Ooh. Let's hope that wasn't Mike. So that goes in there. Oh, yeah, okay. Alright. Um. Alright. So we're moving this little needle uh, around the circle, it looks like. There? Okay. Ah, I see. Alright, hang on. Uh, if we twist it this way... We get another ring, and another one, and another one. Oh, oh, we take, we take the inner ring out. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Um. <laughs> I, I wonder if that actually has to go in that right section. Yeah, that right console. Maybe that would fit, right? Around here? Ah, there you go. Now I can use it. Right. Oh. Oh. It looks like the uh, the butt of a flower or something. I don't know. Oh, what's this? Okay, right. Let's go take a look, shall we? We've got the... Oh, hang on. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, okay, hang on. There's something down there that now I can't use. Right, the walls have gone, though. Right, let's try that again. Maybe I was just too slow. Maybe uh, time is of the essence here. Alright. How about... Just, just leave it in. Just leave it in and I'll come collect it after I've had a little play around with that. Looks like that triangle thing again. No, don't take it out! Oh! Oh, man. Okay, that's not going to work, is it? Right. Okay. So it looks like there's a few of these. Can I use this? Looks like I can. And that's for the elevator? Yes, it is! Alright! We're making progress. Up? Yep, we're going up. Right. Okay. So if we walk around here, we find absolutely nothing, so let's go the other way instead. Another control for the elevator by the looks of it. Whoa! Okay! Wow. I don't like that thing. I'm getting sort of Xenomorph vibes. It's reminding me a little bit of Alien Isolation, what I consider to be one of the scariest games of all time, really. So, yeah. And that's a good and a bad thing, you know? Mike? Could be Mike, right? Could be. Maybe not, though. Might be that thing. Right, again, bit of a dead end. Looks like a, a tunnel has sort of formed here. I don't think it was actually meant to be here, but... Right. Up we go. We're going inside of this thing. What what's all this? Let's see. All right. So okay. All right. So I can select one of these. I think I see someone over there. Oh God. Oh, that's clever. Oh, wow. <laughs> right. Uh, just a load of bodies. Okay. 
Uh, can I move this out of the way or anything? No? Okay, never mind. Never mind. Okay, let's let's go back. Can we retract this thing? Yeah, looks like we can. Okay, so we're, we're creating tunnels, are we? And there's three options. What about this one? The one on the left. Wow. I mean, it's making me squirm, but that's pretty cool. And through we go. Where to, though? <laughs> I think my face is just kind of lit up with wonder right about now. You know? This way? Alright, hang on. Oh. Ah. Okay, another one of these things. I, I brought this with me. Oh, oh, alright. You're gonna make it tricky now, are you? Uh, oh, that... That seemed to line up with that pretty well. Okay, we just gotta be quick. Let's see. Okay, so it's gonna it's gonna match up with this one eventually. So let's just wait. Wait for the click. There it is, there it is! Oh, that one's really quick. Okay, but it's gonna be the top left. Eventually. In a few rotations time. Oh, wait! Got it, got it, okay. And then to the top again? Okay, yes! We've got another one of these things. It looks like there's room for like four or five. We can't use it again. I guess I need to fill it up, right? Right, yeah, okay, now I know where I am. So, what else can we do up here? Okay. That looks like a dead end. Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm not going that way. Down here, though? Is that a console? It is. Right. Mike? I keep hoping to find Mike, but uh, I probably won't, will I? Of course, I don't have my augment. Okay. I'm gonna need to find that machine. I'm gonna need to stick in my arm yet again. Um... Doesn't seem to be here. Right. There was another way to go, I believe. So, let's see. From here, it's going to be to my direct left, isn't it? So, yeah, that one. That's it. <laughs> this is great. It is such a unique experience. I love it. Ooh. I'm not loving that, though. That looks dangerous. Please don't tell me I have to time this and run through. Oh, no. Okay, right. Let's let's not do that quite yet. Let's maybe try something else. Let's go this way. Yeah. Oh, hang on. There's that thing again. Oh, fuck. I'm going to need to find something to defend myself. Where did it go? Did it go this way? Right, okay, let's ignore that tunnel for the time being. Up here? Alright. Hmm. Alright. This way then? Yeah, okay, it looks like the end of the line. I think, to be honest, there is only one way to go, and it's to follow that thing. Damn. Well, maybe it's gonna lead me to another one of these rings, right? Okay. So far, so good. I don't see it. Not yet. Okay. I've been in an area very, very similar to this. But not this. What's that back there? I think we might be on the other side of the fan, to be honest. Oh, fans. Are we gonna remove this? Yeah, we're gonna take it out. And that stops one of the fans. Right, so presumably the other two are going to stop the other two fan blades, yeah? All 
right, and one more. Hopefully this doesn't get me covered in gunk again. No, brilliant. All right, okay. Well, let's just go back rounds and let's run through, right? Oh, wow, okay. Oh boy. Ooh. No, 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 I don't like this. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, it's gripping out my stomach. What the fuck? What is happening? Wait, what, what, what just happened? Okay, that, that hurt, but I've, I've got myself a weapon. I've got this back. And it still works. Okay. Where did that thing go? It's, is it tagging along? Oh god, I, I, I don't know. I don't know. It, it, it seemed to have a, a real good grip on me and then, well, here I am. I'm still alive. Maybe it's like a parasite or something, you know? It's, it's got to live off me. Right, so this thing. I'm wondering if maybe I could insert it here? No? Okay. Uh, I don't think there's anything else for me to really do here. Let's see. Through here? Yeah. Alright. Okay, I can't go to the right side of the fan, but this way? Yeah? Where's this gonna go? <laughs> I guess I don't need to worry about that thing, seeing as it's fucking attached to me now. Alright. Is that a dead end down there? It is, isn't it? Okay. Hold on, though. Ah, ah, it's another one! This is gonna be the, the third ring! After that, I think there's only maybe, like, one more. Right. Let's see, I'm just waiting for the click. Okay, there you go. Providing that it does keep the same pattern, it's not incredibly chaotic. There you go. Simple. Okay, it's gonna be at the top this time. One more rotation should do it. Done. Alright. Again, very fast moving in the middle. Bottom right. Done. Okay. We drag that all to the top. That's number three. Yeah, there's room for one more. Alright. Well, maybe now that I've got this thing, maybe now I can use one more. Hang on. Alright. Looks like we got ourselves another elevator here. And this time we're going down. Alright. Okay. <laughs> I'm still getting used to all the noises that I'm hearing. Ah, ha, ha, there we go. Right, if I can augment myself, that'll do it. Just as painful as last time. Okay. Right. This? Okay, I can use this. With the gun. Alright. So that opens up the gate. And where's this? That's where I found that thing, wasn't it? Right. Right. Okay. Okay, we need to do this, I think, one more time. Now that I've got that augment, what I'm going to do is I'm going to see if I can control whatever's in the middle of that hard. Right, here we are again. This time it should work. I should be able to put in the needle, put on the glove, and do something. Okay, use. Alright. Oh! Oh! Looks like I'm spraying it with acid. Something like that, anyway. Oh, we twist it around. Oh, that what? It's blocked. So is the acid going to melt away the bodies? That's what I'm trying to do, anyway. It might be... Oh, 
They're moving. It is kind of working. I am clearing the way. Is that going to be safe to step on? Oh boy. Uh, right. Okay. Let's leave this alone. Um, the less acid, the better, really. I think we've cleared the way now, so... Let's go back inside. Let's connect the corridor. And let's head in that direction. Hopefully that's where I'm going to find that last ring. Okay, so it's going to be that one ahead of me. I love the way that works. It's fucking horrifying. It's brilliant. There you go. Alright, so... What are we going to find? Hey, that's it, isn't it? That's it! Check this out. That's going to be number four. Oh? Oh, there's there's a cover over half of it. Oh, wait! Okay, there. Yep, right. Okay, now I think we really do need to listen out for the clicks. Oh, yep. Oh, got it, got it. That last one. Oh. Where was that? Was that here? Did I get it? I think I got him! Yes! Okay! Right. We've got four. So, presumably I used that downstairs, yeah? Can't use that? No? Okay. What else we got up here? Not much, really. No. Alright. Well, that's no bother. That's no bother at all. Alright, here we are again. This time with all four rings. So, let's insert it again, see what happens. Oh, they all move, they all come down. Okay. Oh? Okay, it looks like there's another one over there, I guess, but... Oh! Was not expecting that to happen! Alright. So, well, let's see. Let's see. It's not going away this time. What is that? It's like a, a handle. It seems to be locked in position, though. There's something to do with this inverted triangle. Right, what about this one over here? Same kind of thing. This one doesn't seem to be lit up, though. Hmm. I think it's only the one of them that I can use. So... Right. We're still missing something. Right. This thing hasn't got its shield on anymore. Let's have a look. Okay. Alright. Oh, I see. Huh. Hang on. Clever. Clever. Alright, we've got to get all that sorted out so they all go into the slot at the same time and they're not sort of bashing against the walls. So we've got to work from the left right, haven't we? So... That way... That way... I want to go down... Um... And again... And again... Yep... And then, left, up, done! Alright! That was a cool puzzle, I like that! They've all opened up. What's inside? What is that? There's something wriggling inside. What? It, another human? Hang on. Right. Is this gonna work now? Still attached. Okay. What is that thing? Oh, hang on. And what's that? Oh, hey! How you doing? Are they all breaking free? Oh, it might just be this guy. I'm gonna call you Mike too. How you doing? Uh, you're not looking too good, to be honest, no. Right. I, I think maybe I took him out of the oven a little bit too early. 
I think he's done for. Right. 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 Okay, hang on. The only thing I can think of doing now is to to go back and have a look at that door over there. Right? Whatever I just picked up, it seems to have some sort of affinity with the inverted triangle. Right! That's how you open it? So it's it's like it's like a key fob, you know? It's like some remote control. Alright. We've made it to the other side. I don't know if we really needed to go through all that. If I just clambered up here, I could have probably just squeezed through, but okay, alright. Where next? Where next? I've probably got to stop playing soon, but let's play a little bit more. I just want to play a little bit more. That looks like a dead end. Uh, this is looking a little familiar, actually. Yeah. I think maybe I got Mike from an area close to this. Hang on, hang on. There you go. That's it. Another elevator? Are we going up or down? It's gonna be down this time. Alright. I am thoroughly, thoroughly enjoying my time with this game and I hope you're enjoying watching as well. I just don't know what's gonna happen next and I think, for me, that's the best part. Oh. Oh god. It is! It's still attached to me! Oh! Please stop doing that! What the fuck? Okay, so yeah, that bar in the top left, that's... That's my health, right? You can only see it if you hold right click. What's this? I haven't seen this before. What? Okay, in goes that weird spider crab thing and... What? What? Ooh. Okay. It just killed it for me, I think? Right. Well, that was fucking weird. Ah. Has that given me some health reserves? I don't know. I, I, I think so. But I'm not sure. <laughs> This game is all about the unknown and uh, discovering what works, what doesn't. That's half the fun, honestly. I'm not really sure what that did, but hopefully it's going to be a benefit. Where are we going now? Okay. Seems like that's always going to work. Maybe only with that pattern, though. Right. Oh, right! Yeah, okay, I, I know this area. I know this area. Mike might be down there. Covered in this stuff. Right. Oh, wait, no, hang on. Back this way! That door! Right at the beginning! I should be able to open it! Alright. We've gone through some pretty harsh trials and tribulations just to get this door open, but I, I think we're finally going to do it. Yeah, look at all this. I'm trying to figure out exactly, you know, how long it's been since that first section. I think, you know, at least a couple of weeks. So, round to the left, and left again. There we go. Okay, it's still powered up. But this time, I've got the key fob. So we can get it open, right, so. What's this? Well, it looks like it might be another elevator. Alright. They don't look like chains, they look more like bones, like spines, you know? We're going down. Alright. What is all this? 
Okay. Looks like there may be three ways to go here. This is where I'm going to end part one of Scorn. I already know that I'm going to be playing a part two, but if you want to see that on the channel, please let me know about it down below in the comments or by liking the video, alright? Thank you very much for watching, really hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to see you back in the next part very soon. See you then. I think this is like H.R. Geiger's wet dream. I think you would really, really appreciate this. My right hand goes in this glove, which is disgustingly connected. Yeah, I don't like the way the fingers just go in there. Hey again, buddy. So sorry for last time. Oh God. Oh no. Oh my com- Oh, I'm so sorry, Mike. I wish I, oh, I wish I could help him. Oh man, I feel so sorry for Mike. I need to give his arm the augment, right? Oh wow! Again, I think it's going to be pretty painful. It didn't look very. Oh, oh, right. I don't think that's supposed to happen. Oh, oh, that's massive. All right. Oh, jeez! That's even bigger! Where is this place? What is this place? Why is this place? I've got so many questions! Oh... Oh dear. Looks like that triangle thing again. No, don't take it out! Oh! Another control for the elevator by the looks of it. Oh, okay! I think I see someone over there! Oh, God! Oh, uh, uh, okay. Alright. Oh, right. Yeah, okay, I, I know this area. 